Behold, the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka! Asuka, absolutely incredible with what she has accomplished in such a short time here. Well on her way to becoming one of the best ever. You know, I will never forget the first time I saw Asuka enter the NXT arena. She had so much buzz surrounding her debut, and I, I think it's safe to say Asuka has certainly lived up to her reputation. One of the most dominant female superstars ever in WWE. All hands on deck. Please walk the plank, Byron, please. Guys, we have a big-time tag team match coming up here. A big-time match with big-time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. these girls. WWE's resident mean girls under the bright lights on the big stage exactly where the Iconics belong. be two of my most trusted sources. Oh, I believe that. This is iconic. The Australian duo have taken WWE by storm and show no signs of slowing down. Two ladies who have known each other since high school in Sydney, Australia, now causing havoc and dismay. And goodness gracious, they do great impressions. They're horrible. WWE Women's Tag Team introducing first from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! And their opponents, they are the WWE Women's Champions, Peyton Royce and Billy Kay, the Iconic.
Stay right where you are, people. Byron, you want to know just how confident Peyton Royce is of her abilities? In 2016, she was one of the very few women brave enough to actually call out Asuka. Uh, keep in mind, though, Michael, Peyton wasn't by herself when she called out Asuka. She had Billy Kay by her side. It's not like Peyton was looking for a one-on-one -on -one battle. Doesn't get any better than this. We're about to witness tag team action at its finest, fellas. Byron brings up a great point that I should have mentioned. Peyton's bravado certainly intensified when Billy Kay was by her side. Strength in numbers, there's nothing wrong with that. In fact, I encourage it. Just go back and look at what the Iconics were able to do together when they ambushed Asuka in the parking lot. Harsh impact. Champ's starting to sweat. To be expected, though, given the competition she's in there with tonight. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches Man. her breath in the corner. From the looks of things, it just doesn't appear to be her night. But hey, it's still early enough for her to get back Jeez. into this thing. Nailed it! Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. Pick! The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage, and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record setting 483 days. He's able to get out of the way there. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. All measured up. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. Somebody's got hops. We're looking at complete domination here. Irish whip. Kyrie Sane. Big move coming. Boom, what impact. It, is that it? Is it over? Kyrie Sane has been called the Pirate Princess and is the name she's truly earned. Before stepping in the ring, she actually competed in Yuck. Kyrie Sane, big move coming. Insane elbow. This one's over, guys. This is not good. I don't think Billy Kay knows where she is. She goes for the cover. The pin's broken up. Corey debated the validity of Kyrie Sane's nickname. But I'm walking the plank for the Pirate Princess. She dresses the part, and she's always on the hunt for treasure, particularly the NXT Women's Championship. Saxton, don't make me send you to Davy Jones' locker, you land lover. When Sane starts to show me an edge, maybe then I'll admit she's more than just a scouting rag. Oh, continuing to punish them! Stomach. And look at the quickness by Sane.
Born in Australia, Peyton Royce's path to WWE saw her travel many miles, including a stop in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, where, like many before her, Peyton honed her craft before ultimately joining WWE. Peyton Royce is able to get out of the way. Oh, you gotta love Peyton oh, Royce. Oh. That spinning leg lariat. There it is. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Corey Byron did allude to Peyton Royce's training in Canada. Yeah, she's a product of your best friend Lance Storm, and that's one of the reasons why Peyton is so good in the ring. I'm just glad Storm's personality didn't rub off on her during training. Peyton Royce. Suplex. Great usage of her hips. Another one. Could the third time be the charm, Byron? I think so. Perfect. Looks like she's clearly not getting paid by the hour. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed, and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling Best of Seven series, I wouldn't think they developed into a top tag team. I think she's trying to prove a point here. And look at the quickness by Sane. I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized. Kyrie Sane, big move coming. This might be it. Oh, my. Now it's time to capitalize. Oh, man, Peyton Royce is in trouble. Kyrie Sane. This is all but over. Beautiful technique. That's all she wrote, fellas. What a tag team display. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. Man, oh man, look at that. This was another great moment. Remember this? And here's a last look at this one. And there's your winner via submission. If you're not feeling good about yourself after a win like that, you better get yourself checked. And that's yet another great match the city of Baltimore has hosted over the years.